One of the things that I always talk about in my circles or just conversation is that you have to find a way to be different and unique. Now as a business owner, say you own a restaurant, that's hard because there's so many restaurants that are gonna be just like you or whatever you're aspiring to do. There's probably somebody else doing that same thing. I own a video and marketing production company. There's a lot of us out there, but it's how you find that little way to be unique and stand out, that's gonna be the difference maker. So I have a story from when I was doing a lot of acting. So I was up for role on Days of Our Lives and we flew out to LA and I was competing with a whole bunch of other people for that same role, same script, same everything. When I went into that room, we didn't know what the other person was going to do in our audition. So I was with a bunch of higher ups from NBC and Days of Our Lives and I knew I had a very small you know, window of opportunity to, to make you know, my presence felt. So this was a role for a forensics analyst. And before the line started and I, you know, was doing my acting, my scene, I pulled out gloves and I put them on and then I pulled out a small notepad and I started taking notes and I started looking around the room. And they all looked at me like, what is he doing? And then I delivered my lines as a forensics analyst. When I was done, a couple hours later, they called me and they said, you got the role. And part of the reason that I got the role was because I didn't just go in like everybody else and just deliver the lines. I took a step and I was unique and I was a little bit different. So in your business venture, you've got to find that uniqueness and that little bit of difference that makes you stand out above everybody else. See you next time.